Welcome Ridge Life, I'm Tim, and today on Ramblings, we are not on the ridge anymore. Well, we're definitely up, just not on the ridge. We are on Mount Magazine here in Arkansas, guys, and we, we wanted to do these ramblings, today's ramblings, from the top of the mountain at the State Park Lodge. We couldn't do it. Why couldn't we do it? Couldn't see five feet in front of us. <laughs> because we were in the clouds, guys. We're about really only a third of the way up the mountain right now. And you can see this beautiful view behind us. We're about a third of the way up. It's like 2,750 feet uh, up on top of the uh, Mount Magazine, the highest point in Arkansas. Well, we, we got about two thirds of the way up and it got cloudy we were in the clouds and we we pulled over we, once we got there we had to slow down to like two mile an hour it was crazy and it wasn't like fog because when we got up there we pulled over at the uh, the lodge and you, you couldn't even see the lodge no i mean 10 feet in front of you but we pulled over got out and the clouds were rolling past us in the parking lot because we're so high up <laughs> It was, I, it was a little creepy to me. It, kind of creepy. I mean, I mean, you're from the flatlands of Osceola, Blyville, Arkansas, right? The cotton right. fields and the Mississippi River. Not used to this. <laughs> this is, the, we're not in Kansas I anymore. had to ask for a gun because my ears were popping the whole way. Yeah, but, <laughs> um, so hopefully tomorrow, uh, it had a little bit of rain last night, so it's a little bit cloudy. Uh, it was 50 some odd degrees in Havana at the base of the mountain. 30, what, what is 37? 37 degrees at the top of the mountain. But tomorrow's supposed to be sunnier and a little bit warmer, I think. So hopefully when we get up in the morning, we'll be able to come outside and show you what it really looks like. Uh, I mean, th this is gorgeous right here. Uh, the Blue Mountain Lake's right over there. Havana's over there. Um, the 41.36 is right over there. Uh, come on mountains right over there. And uh, we're gonna be on both tomorrow are you excited to go I'm to i'm very excited i can't wait to see it <laughs> she's heard so much about all you know all the family goings and comings on come on mountain and the 41.36 yet she's never been there uh she's actually camped with the family right you got I to did, we yeah, on day for da david's birthday lake wachita and uh that was fun wasn't it, it was. and it was early it early in our relationship and you got to meet the family then and basically i had to uh, introduce her to the family early because if she get if they gave her a thumbs down, <laughs> nah, I would never do that. I would never do that. Yeah, people get on you again. <laughs> I know you shouldn't put other people's uh, you know opinions ahead of your own. Blah blah blah. Well, well, they they all gave her a big thumbs up, and it's been six months now, so I think it's been all right. <laughs> we had a great time last night. We went to uh, Conway, Arkansas, which Conway's a nice town. It is. It's the downtown area, the I guess there's three colleges, three major colleges there. Mm -hmm. And uh, we had a little birthday, our birthday, Jesus' birthday. Uh, we had a, <laughs> a, a Christmas celebration with Lauren and her boyfriend and uh, went out to eat. And uh, I didn't get seafood. He didn't. I did. Well, <laughs> yes, you did. Yes, you did. I did. Of course, I, I guess. about today. Oh, <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, I, I had I had sea scallops with we bacon. Went to Mike's place. Mike's in place Conway. in Conway. It was nice. It was really nice. Uh, now, uh, Parker, right? Parker. Yeah. Parker had the shrimp and grits. I didn't see the shrimp and grits on the menu um, until I, he'd already ordered and I already had the sea scallops in my mind. Uh, but delicious. The shrimp and grits, baby. I don't do grits, but I do shrimp and grits. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> um, so we had a great time. Uh, then we went back to Lawrence and we opened Christmas presents, our first Christmas presents opening of the year. And I love mine. Thank you, Lauren. Thank you, Jen Jen. Um, they uh, surprised me. We, we did lists, so we kind of knew what we we're going to get. Um, but they, they kind of went above and beyond because they, they, they got something that was kind of on my list, but not on my list. And I was very, very happy. So very, very happy. Were you happy with your gifts? Yeah. Show them my necklace. Uh, oh yeah. They can see it. <laughs> that is a, it's a Harley Davidson heart necklace. It is a black hearts with diamonds and a silver heart intertwined with a Harley Davidson logo above it. Love it. <laughs> She's a hearty girl. <laughs> uh, but um, so today we got up and then we had brunch with Lauren at a Irish pub in Conway. O'Malley's. O'Malley's Irish pub. Yep. And uh, I had bangers and champs and it didn't look too good. 
tastes delicious. Bangers and Champs are a sausage, mashed potatoes, and brown gravy. It was delicious. And what'd you have? It was sort of like a shepherd's pie. What, what was it? It wasn't called shepherd's pie. It was called... It was something pie. Yeah, no, I, I don't remember. It was, it was like good. a shepherd's pie. It was like basically a stew, uh, beef stew on top of mashed potatoes, right? Mm -hmm. And it, 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 she gave me a bite of it. It was some good. gravy and mm, 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 mm. some rice with it. And then Lauren had breakfast, right? She had pancakes. Um, so then we headed over here and uh, talked to David on the way up here. David's going to head up here soon. Uh, so he's going to come on on up. Got a couple traffic little traffic going by there but David's gonna head up here to Mount Magazine we're gonna hang with him a little bit for the rest of the family get here um, and I hope they can get up to the mountain because I mean seriously guys I hope we, they don't wait till six because it'll start getting dark and I don't know it can get any worse it won't be cloudy though will it I don't dark? know it's the clouds I don't do clouds at night right I mean, I mean it's not fog it was clouds yeah. that was not fog so I don't know I, I really don't know in the mountains like how this works all right do you, do you guys think the clouds are going to be there at night I mean I mean there's clouds at night but it is it going to right are the clouds going to rise you think or are they going to get lower but hope, yeah. family, when you're driving up there tonight, we're going to put this video out here in a little bit. So family, when you're driving up tonight, be careful. Be careful. Be careful. It's very, very froggy out there. Uh, froggy. <laughs> froggy, yeah. It's Froggy 101. <laughs> Who knows what that is? <laughs> um, but we're hoping tomorrow when we get up, uh, because the lodge is on the very top side of Mount Magazine, overlooking Blue Mountain Lake and the Wachita Mountains, the Blue Mountain, all that. And we're hoping, we, and we have a balcony facing awesome. that way. So hopefully when we get up in the morning, the sun's coming up and she gets to see the view. Actually, that's gonna be pretty cool because you don't, you're not gonna see it. You don't see it now, right? Because there was a couple of lookouts at the top as we drove by and you couldn't see the, you couldn't see the lookout rail, much less past the rail. So hopefully we get up in the morning. Get some coffee. Coffee and... on the balcony with that yeah. beautiful view. Woo! I think if we get up in the morning and it's still cloudy, can you imagine coming all the way up to uh, Mount Magazine State Park Lodge? Not being able to see a thing. And not being able to see a thing. <laughs> that would be terrible. I had to get that drone up. And hope, but even the drone's not going to be able to see the top because of the clouds. I can't fly the drone in the, in the clouds like that. Yeah. But, um, yeah, so uh, we got confirmation. David's coming tonight. Uh, Jeff, Bobblehead Homestead, Drew and Lindsay into the mist and uh, Drew's lens and Drew's Lens Reacts. And uh, I believe Melanie and Gary of Simple Life Reclaim. I believe they're bringing the kids. Uh, I believe Hat Creek Homestead, Dawn's gonna be there. And I believe Possum Run, Mama V is gonna be there. And I, that's the only confirmation. I talked to Anthony from Country Road Cure. And uh, Anthony, they were out all day today shopping, Christmas shopping and stuff. Anthony said, I'll just see you tomorrow. We're, 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 gonna, have, we're gonna have a long day of it. So they're gonna stay back on the 41. Pool. 0.36 take care of everything while Melanie and Gary are up here on uh, Mount Magazine. So we'll see Anthony and Roxanne and Wyatt tomorrow. And uh, let's see. Um, the Beast has been pretty comfortable, hasn't it? Yes, yeah. We, uh, we watched The Night Agent. I mean, sorry. She watched The Night Agent on Netflix on the way over here. I'm driving, of course. I would never watch... Uh, I would never watch Netflix on the 13-inch screen in the dash of the truck while I'm driving. I would never do that. I was like, I would never do that. <laughs> he doesn't, he's a good driver. <laughs> yeah, I don't know about that. <laughs> I drive, I don't know if I'm a good driver. You're probably a better driver than I am. I don't, probably. I don't, I'm not that really good yeah. driver. <laughs> Ran a stop sign yesterday in Conway. <laughs> oh my goodness, so yeah, we're in Conway get, going out to dinner and uh, Park, Parker and Lauren are in the back, me and Ginger in the front, and I'm talking, I'm looking, um, trying to get directions and I was not paying attention to traffic signals there was a stop sign and this is downtown area and this big old this the beast just goes right through I, I guess the thing is like if you were at a stop stop a stop sign or a crossing and a tank was coming up and the tank ran through the stop sign what would you do be like let it go yeah. Yeah. so that's what this is the, the beast is a tank can't stop it people are just gonna <laughs> be like frozen let it go right let it go <laughs> Nobody was around, so it was no, I, no, I, I, did, I didn't almost call. But if someone would have hit us, I think we'd been all right. Yeah. I don't know if they would have been all right, but we'd been all right. <laughs> been a pretty smooth ride too. Um, I've taken this, uh, I've taken the beast down to Florida, so I, I know it, it rides good, and actually gets fairly good fuel mileage too. So I've been pretty happy with that. But coming up the top of this mountain, that big old uh, 6.7 high output, 
glory. It was roaring getting up here. <laughs> but all right, uh, let's see how long we've been on the on the jingy jingy here. All right, about 10 minutes. I'm gonna walk you around a little bit, give you a little bit of a, a, a basically a sneak peek of what we see. Okay, guys. So, uh, Jin Jin, what you guys say to everybody? We have to watch out for bears. Bears? Yeah, there's bear signs everywhere. <laughs> Lions and tigers. I was just and thinking. Uh, <laughs> yeah, she, you ain't leaving me here. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta watch my back. <laughs> I'm gonna get, get your pew pew out. <laughs> all right, she's gonna stay with us all. So I'm gonna grab a hold of you, and then I'm gonna show you what the view looks like on this side of the mountain. Look at this, guys. Okay. That is beautiful. Not quite as beautiful as that, but that's beautiful. <laughs> All right, guys, we're gonna get to the top of the mountain, get this uploaded. Dave's gonna come up there and uh, we're gonna get ready for the Framily Christmas celebration. And I'm told Santimifer might be there. <laughs> How can you even say that <laughs> That's word? hard, Santimifer, right? <laughs> Santa. Timifer, Santa may have some <laughs> presents for the Framily, right? Matter of fact, ho, 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 ho. we got presents for the family. Y'all better get up here. Santa for what? Put coal in your stocking. <laughs> Lose my boot there. All right. All right, guys. We have rambled on long enough. So we're going to let you go. We're going to go on top of this mountain. Until next time, I hope everyone has a blessed, blessed day. Keep rambling and go Ridge Life. Go Ridge Life. <laughs>